crumbly shell, mold to middle, and some ice cream to cool it off. The perfect lava cake. Let's get started. This one's super easy. You will need 170 grams of bittersweet chocolate, 1 4 cup sugar, 2 tablespoons flour, 113 grams unsalted butter, 2 whole eggs and 2 egg yolks, and a pinch of salt. We also need 4 ramekins for the cake. We start off by greasing the ramekins with butter. You can use a wrapper of the butter to do this. I like using cocoa powder to coat the greased dishes. It gives it that extra hit of chocolate. But you can use plain flour or icing sugar too. Now we melt the chocolate and butter on defrost mode in the microwave. Make sure to stir in the middle to avoid the chocolate from burning. Once mixed, set aside to cool. Whip up the eggs, sugar and a pinch of salt till it reaches a light, fluffy consistency. This could take 5 minutes or so. Now slowly mix in the cooled chocolate butter mixture till well combined. Finally, add in the flour and mix well. Use an ice cream scoop or a big spoon to pour in the mixture into the ramekins. I'm going to bake mine in a preheated oven at 200 degrees Celsius for 10 minutes. If you like the lava very runny, bake for 8 minutes instead. The great thing about this dessert is that it can be tucked away in the fridge for several hours and then baked later once at room temperature. You know, for those rainy days. Once the cake is cooked, remove from the oven and let it sit for a minute. Then turn it upside down on your dish and remove the ramekin. Be careful, this is very very hot. Let it sit for another 10 seconds. Add whatever flavor of ice cream you fancy, vanilla goes best. This lava cake is your one-way ticket to dessert heaven. Bon voyage!